Here we are in the Roadshow Kitchen. Our friend Nick Raybar from Avenue N joins us. We got sausage and biscuits on the menu. Yep. That's one of those things that's, <laughs> you know, it's one of those like comfort foods is going to fill you up. Yes. If the sausage doesn't, uh, you know, <laughs> if, the biscuits. If, right, right. Look at this. Beautiful. You know, we're going to make this look beautiful today, okay. Will. I you trust know, you. You know, sausage and biscuits, you're right. It is comfort food. Mm -hmm. And it's been done a thousand different ways. Right. So how do you make it a little bit different? How do you have a little bit of fun with it? Uh, we're going to make uh, butternut squash biscuits today. Okay. So super. Well, healthy that's that's healthy. I didn't say anything about this was healthy today it's got a vegetable well it doesn't it, we're incorporating a vegetable and a little bit of chive also yeah. no listen it's not about health it's about breakfast it's about uh this is an any time of the day meal really sure well, it's it's uh it's so we have a little all-purpose flour we have a little bit of sugar we have a little bit of baking powder we have a little bit of whole milk I took butternut squash and I roasted it and I pureed it mm -hmm. very very simple to do you can uh, boil it if you need to in a little salted water okay and a little bit of butter okay so no I didn't say it was healthy but I am gonna say it's delicious and a lot of times I come here I do do healthy things yeah not today not today we're just gonna make a fun dish so then we're gonna saute now sausage okay mm -hmm. and we're gonna caramelize that up real well we're gonna remove it and we're gonna make an, a three onion white gravy with this with Oof. a little bit of cheddar cheese and if we have time we're gonna do a fried egg on top oh we're gonna have time okay and then we'll, <laughs> the, we'll have the we're gonna go for the full hour all right so we're gonna do it then we're gonna do it so and I'm gonna show you a fun technique as to how to fry an egg something okay. a little bit different so everything here is just a little bit different so your traditional white gravy we're going to incorporate we have the southern onions the Vidalia onions right we have a little bit of chive we have a little bit of scallion we have a little bit of cheddar cheese real southern ingredients here done in a real fun different new new way dude this is comfort food yeah, if you want some, if you want some comfort food for a cold snowy day or whatever day it is <laughs> this is what to make we will put this together in just a little bit also talk to Nick about what's going on at the restaurant back to you back in the road show kitchen this yes. morning here he is the man of the hour we love him Nick Raybar right back at you, from buddy. Avenue N American kitchen in yes. the pantry, of course, and today you, sir, have been leading us to the promised land by making some sausage and biscuits. Sausage and biscuits. A classic, sausage buddy. Sausage and biscuits, we get the sausage sautéing right All right. Here, okay, so I'm going to ask you to sort of just chop away at that to sort of break it up so it crumbles a little bit in the pan while I kind of get the base of the biscuits going. Hashtag sautéing sausage. Yes. Here yes. we go. All right. Now, You've entrusted me with this. We're now, working together now. I love it, and now I'm going to start to go into this, to this beautiful biscuit. So I got about a cup and a half of flour in here to a half cup of the um, of the butternut squash puree that I roasted down. I'm going to go in with a half cup of milk. Okay. About a tablespoon of salt. I'm sorry, a tablespoon of sugar. Pinch of salt. Okay. Okay. Just a little pinch. Just a pinch. And you're going to put in about one and a half. Uh, tablespoons of baking powder. Now, baking powder is a critical ingredient in biscuits because it's what makes it rise. Right. It's, it's uh, it makes them light and fluffy, and you can substitute buttermilk if you're a believer in that. And you can see how um, how this ratio is really working out well here. Okay. Um, I'm going to fold in about three tablespoons of chopped butter as well. All right. So, how am I doing over here? You're with doing the great, actually. Sausage. You're doing great, and try to give it a little flip and start to caramelize the other side. It okay. should be browning up nicely. All right, then. And so oh, yeah, it is. Look at that. Yeah, it's beautiful. So I feel I'm a part of it. Yes, you are a part of it. And, you know, <laughs> and, 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 you know everyone's a part of it. But right. while we're away, I need to talk about a couple critical steps. Go what I'm going to do is, while we're not here, before we get to the next one, I've got to get these biscuits cooking to finish to finish this. Okay. So I'm going to lay this out, and I'm going to use this here. I'm just going to sneak behind you, which is called a uh, a biscuit cutter. Okay. okay. Biscuit cutter is Perfect better. name for it. And, well, that's exactly right. So I'm going to lay this out, and I'm going to hole punch six beautiful biscuits. Okay. Beautiful. Then I'm going to take some onion and start to caramelize that as well in there. All right. All right. We're going to wrap up for now. We'll wrap for Check now. Check in with you one last time. You got it. You got the, it. The bespectacled buddies yes. right here. <laughs> fighting crime and breaking hearts. Stay, Stay with us. Uh -huh. Chef Nick Raybar. Sausage and biscuits on the menu. Back to you. Back in the Roadshow Kitchen, Chef Nick Raybar's here. Avenue N is the place. And look, if you are looking for some comfort food, something to fill you up, well, I'm not telling you it's healthy. It's just good. Oh, oh, Sausage good and biscuits is what Sometimes we're making. Sometimes it can just be it's good. Fine. Oh. You're going to be fine. All right, lighten up afterwards. Take it easy. Have an avocado for lunch. Sure. You'll be fine. An absolute <laughs> classic here. So here at... Kirby's Cafe. Kirby's well, Cafe. this is a one-time yeah. only. I'm only open today. Yeah. <laughs> it's a non-existent eatery right there. Well, you've got a good menu item. And if I will I'm say looking that. for a chef, send me your resume. Yeah. Uh, so depending on how good this is. I will I would <laughs> gladly work there. And I'm gonna put you to work a little bit here too. Okay, what are we doing? So I want to explain something real quick. I got the biscuits in the oven. I got I put in uh, a little bit of butter and flour and I made a roux with the sausage mm -hmm. and the caramelized onions, and then I put it in milk. This is a white gravy, very southern style white gravy, okay? Great. I'm gonna put in some of the other onions now so I'm gonna put in a little scallion Ooh. 
and I'm gonna put in a little chive. Now, uh, Brandon, would you get, get a little bit of uh, cracked pepper in there? Would you okay. like some fresh ground pepper? Yeah, put a, I would, <laughs> I'd be very, I'd love to. I'd love to. We would love it very much, I love some fresh ground yeah. pepper. And That's now you enough. see. I was, that, yeah, I was yeah, gen gentle, <laughs> but generous. This, right. this cafe of yours is quite, <laughs> it's got our a heavy first hand day. with the pepper. It's our first day. All right, see so, what the ratings are in Yelp. Now take a look here, take a look. This came out okay, right? Looks good And you see it's not too thick, it's not too thin. Now, the biscuits, right? Let's start biscuits. Biscuit this time. is the moment right this, here, okay? Oh, These are hot, man. and you can see they wow. just have a little bit of the tint of the color uh, to them. So I'm gonna pass over a biscuit here. Thank you. Okay, and I'm gonna say, just use that knife. You should be able to handle it there, and cut it cut it on open. Like cut this it on one? open, yep. Put it on open, and put it sort of open face on the plate. Now, I'm gonna also, so what I'm gonna do, yep, just like so. I'm something of a biscuit case. Yes, yes you are. <laughs> so now I'm gonna take some of this gravy, Okay, Man. and I'm gonna put it right on top of the biscuits. Whoa. So these, this is this is done. Like you're good here. Look at right? that. I love the way it overflows. Yes, it should, and that's you know. So you're you're totally fine. You don't have to do anything else. But we're gonna push our luck because oh. it's what we do. And I'm gonna put a fried egg on top. So you take a little bit of oil, right? Mm -hmm. And the pan's got to be hot, hot, hot. All right. Okay, hot, hot, hot. A little and olive oil. Yeah, a little oil. Okay. And I'm gonna throw just a little bit of butter also. There you yeah, go. that sizzle, see that smoke. Sizzle city. Okay, now. Mayor Nick Rabar. We'll take an egg, right? Right. And we'll one hand it, we'll go right in. Okay, now, see how it's just like going crazy? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we'll just let it do its thing. All right, hit it with a pinch of salt. Don't mess with that egg. And you can see it's like quickly bubbling up. Now, now at this point, what we're gonna do is we're gonna base the top with some of this hot, hot butter hot oil, right? Whoa, okay. And we're going to kind of fry it from the top of the egg. And that's going to cook it and leave it nice and sunny side. So, Pepper, would you be so kind? I would be there? so kind. Right. A little bit there. Chef you tell me you when? Yep, go with a little bit of that. A little more? And now we go. have this, like, crazy, beautiful, Holy it's like no. crispy sunny. See how it was like, yeah. boom, all right? Underneath is going to be nice and brown and crisp. On top is going to look just like just this. Just like that? Yeah, bubbled and beautiful, and the yolk's gonna run. So we're gonna have a touch of runny yolk right on top of this, of this masterpiece oh, here, okay? Come so on. now you're in good shape to eat it as is. Like I said, you could eat it as is prior to. The biscuit has been it. submerged yeah. in Holy deliciousness. Yeah, so I'm gonna say someone grab a fork okay. uh, and crack know. that sucker. Will, I'm gonna send it down that. your way. Watch okay. that egg. Okay. Will is gonna be the official taste tester yeah. for yeah. Kirby's Cafe. Oh, so. We will give this a little you're taste. You're the guinea pig of the day there, Will. Dip. We need a little biscuit in there. All right, so let me just recap. We did the butter, the butternut squash biscuits, something a little bit different. Yep. Mm -hmm. We took the, the, the typical southern white gravy with sausage. We added three types of onions. We did a fried egg, but we did a crispy sun. So really, really crispy on the bottom, right? And nice and sunny on top. And if you were to poke that yolk, oh my God, poke that yolk, yolk well, poke that yolk, poke the yolk. Hashtag poke the yolk and watch what happens. See, you get that run. And now you have that beautiful. So we cooked it right. We so we did everything right here at Kirby's Cafe. No, today. I'm <laughs> gonna start this restaurant off on the right. You are going to get a good review. I yeah, hope so. This but it's not. Awesome. It's not about Kirby's Cafe today. It's about this guy, Nick Raybar from Avenue N. Thank, well, thank you. Thank always you. a great pleasure wow, to have you is, here. It's always fun to be here. It wow. is every Will single time. Gilbert approved. Oh, good. Excellent. Good, good, good. We have rendered him speechless. <laughs> Again, this is the guy, Nick Raybar. If you'd like that delightful recipe for the sausage and yes. biscuits, just head on over to roadshow.com. Get this recipe. That's a good one. Wow. <laughs> All right.